I was on the ground in Ukraine in 2023 with uh, different American delegations. I was there since 2022 on different uh, American delegations. And from the very beginning, there there been massive interest in, in um, you know, right now, Ukraine has no uh, air flights over it. Obviously, the entire, no domestic kind of flights are going to go. And so outside uh, firms were interested in developing their drone technology, not for military, but for delivery ser services. So given the fact that it's going to take, let's say they sign a peace sale today, there's no way that Ukraine can open up its airports for another six, uh, five or six months in terms of staffing, in terms of security procedures, et cetera. We might have a, a, a period where what the outside uh, Western drone makers were interested in, which is right now they are limited to a ceiling, I think of 500 uh, uh, feet or something in the United States. I, I don't remember, but they can, they can test their delivery services in, a, in, a, in an environment where it's open skies. They don't have to worry about crashing into airplanes. And uh, and go forwards. 